between Nick Diaz and Derek Brunson. You ready to fight? Ready. All right, so with that touch of the gloves, we are underway with this stand-up only fight. A couple of rules in play here, we remind you. No grappling of any type. Also, fighters cannot do any follow-up strikes on the floor. Let's see how it plays out. That landed. Look at that nasty jab. Good defense there. Just out of range with that right hand. Oh, Diaz is hooked to the body, appearing to be blocked by the defense. Well, he leans right into that hook shot, Joe, and that is certainly something that bears watching here moving forward. I know he's confident in his chin, but he's a sitting duck there walking right into the pocket. Oh, oh, he's got him hurt here. Oh, look at this. Who saw that? Nice leg kick. <laughs> Missed the mark. Oh! This could be it. Oh! And he lands a big right hand counter. Hard left hand. Oh, straight right. Slips the punch nicely there. How about that chin? Strong defense there to block the shot. Nice instincts. Diaz gets caught by that straight punch. His defense has abandoned him tonight. Head off the center line, slips the puck. These guys are exchanging huge shots. All right, two minutes now to go in the round. Tags him with the straight hand there. Beautifully done by Diaz. Just out of range with the straight left hand. That one hurt. He's got good accuracy on that jab. Oh, strong punch there by Diaz. Lands the right punch and follows it up with a nice left hand. Nice sequence there by Brunson. Pretty good straight punch for him there, Joe. Clocks the shot. Diaz gets hit by that kick to the body. Back and oh, forth we go. Oh, oh, huge right hand. This could be it right here. 30 seconds to go. Oh, nice punch there by Diaz. Ten seconds to go. Brunson's lower jaw is just nasty at this point. Really swollen in that oh. area now. Round two next. Here's a huge punch to the head that stuns his opponent. And here we see another huge punch that stuns his opponent. And here's one more massive punch he lands that really stuns. You can see the exchange in that Wait, round. Right. Incredible right. action by both fighters. All right, round two. That last round was absolutely insane. If this round gets off to anything like the last round, one of these guys is going out. I can't imagine a scenario where if they continue where they left off in the last round, that one of these guys doesn't get knocked out. Oh, he's in big trouble. Kick there. Shot is blocked there by Diaz. Lands a good combination. Whoa! Whoa! Oh! He's very wobbly. He's trying to hang on. Hard hook. Oh! What a leg kick. Oh, a huge block there. Well, Joe, I know he respects the power coming back, but it looked like he moved right into that kick to the body, and his opponent landed it flush. So let's see if he changes up his footwork a little bit and tries to avoid further damage to the midsection moving forward. 
Well, the right hand has been there at times, not that time. Well, the offense has been there. He is landing some good shots, but not really stringing them together and putting combinations on his opponent. He's got to mix up his strikes, change his tempo a little bit, and try to get his opponent out of there by landing more than just one strike at a time. Just over two minutes to go. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are gonna take their toll as this fight goes on. Oh, he gets hit! He's badly, badly hurt. Oh! Hard straight punch. Well, his corner was pretty urgent after round one. A little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the pace here, and as a result, he has taken control of this second round. Nice punch by Brooks. to the body here, another strike lands there. Oh, that lead left hand has been money. And that's the end of round number two. And there is the horn, big five minutes for him there, great round from Diaz. There was a huge moment in that round and a huge moment in this fight. Here's another look at it here. And let's get a better look at it from a different angle. Third round underway. Wow. Wow. He's trying to hang on. Big shots. Just misses with the jab there. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Oh! He's in a lot of trouble. Just missed. He hurt him again. Oh, he stunned again. Watson gets up again here, Joe. He is Whoa. He's out. Whoa. What power that guy has in his hands. Yeah, Joe, beautiful shot to end the fight right there. It couldn't have landed much more flush than it did, and I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming, quite frankly. So near-perfect execution on the strike that ultimately results in the KO here tonight. Let's take one more look at this overhand right on the money, and the fight is over as soon as it lands. And here we see it again. Boom! And he's out. And there he is, all smiles. What a huge knockout he turned in here tonight. That is one they'll be talking about for some time. We set it inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer for the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is called to stop this contest at one minute, 13 seconds of round number three. Declaring the winner by knockout, Nick Diaz! So congratulations to Nick Diaz. You see the celebration is on for Caesar Gracie fight team. Just absolutely great to see one of the most popular fighters 